Yes, what's going on? We're back here, Summer Plan 2012, the third of four main event battles of the night, man. Shouts out everybody from the Northwest in the building, couple Southerners, couple Midlands, everyone's fucking rolling well through, man. This is no flop, it is no flop of fucking day. Thanks to everybody with the on stage passes, the backstage passes, everybody who bought the early bird passes, people who bought tickets on the door. It's been a sick fucking night so far. We're gonna get into the last two battles of the evening. On the right hand side, I'm gonna introduce with a mic because I'm losing my voice. Flex did. Make some noise. Let's go. Yeah. 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 Flex. Always. I've been in that low flop since the beginning. You know the score. Okay. And on my left hand side, the only international opponent I'm announcing of tonight from Malaysia. We got Zayn Azwai. Make some noise. Yeah. Yeah. Shouts to Zayn. Shouts to Flex. So, uh, matchup has been very long time in the waiting. We finally made it happen for Summer Black in 2012, you know? Okay, uh, Flex won the flip and he chose to go first. He's, uh, so yeah, he's up first. I'm gonna put the mic back. Let's get into his battle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, I hear that Zayn's lost a lot of weight and how he's looking anorexic. So when he goes, Jimmy goes in like a man possessed of weird count and pat massive sweat and pounds of fat and flabby shredded. It would give a number so long that reading would be a natural anaesthetic. But let me ask a question. Do you still have a fetish for Mackie's breakfasts? Do you still catch erections when you think about a glass of Nesquik? <laughs> Wait a minute, do you understand sarcasm? Because you still look about as athletic as a paralytic slightly no. pregnant and just because you run your mouth and stretch the truth it isn't classless calisthenics. Mm. So who can blame him? He's Malaysian. When he yam and scram the lot. So I'm here to avenge every mammal, bat and frog that has lost its life in your country's kitchen pans and woks. <laughs> See this faggot wasn't going to do this class but agreed to take the battle cause he heard about the notorious weather in Manchester today and how it would be raining cats and dogs. <laughs> After to the test, I took Zane to the zoo and he got confused and asked for a table for two. <laughs> Malaysia, the country where women fornicate with corpse remains. So if I get scorched today, I'll return to fuck you up after I form a great army of every squid that died being forced into the arsehole of every whoring that disgusting fucking porn you make. <laughs> plus, I saw your, plus I saw your latest few battles. I give you props on the L's clash. That shit looked like the first ever rap battle that was sponsored by Mencap. <laughs> and the only way you'll get gash is looking for a sketch to rape. The last time Zayn sexed a dame, he got teary-eyed. Well, that's fairly common after getting sprayed with pepper spray. <laughs> so you'll never get a dame. You make girls run fucking miles, so the only way is getting kissed by a bitch is if she's dared to. On a bush tucker trial. <laughs> So you were never living as a car thief just trying to struggle to survive in a far east slum Fuck your diplomat father and the cards he funds an Asian overpaid to play your money damaged Park G Sung oh. yeah. Time, let's go Zayn! Real fact, you real fact, your ex dumped you because you're savagely abusive uh. You couldn't get it up unless you smacked her with your two fists. Uh. You're a vibrator. You only get turned on for sex when there's battery included. Uh. What else? But when street dudes get physical, then he's feeble and pitiful. You're like a cross-dresser when I start repeatedly hitting you because when you get beat down, you know what it's like to be in your bitch's shoes. Uh. <laughs> He always, he always moans about misfortune, emotional each morning. You were raped in jail because you're a police force informant. You, <laughs> you exaggerate to make small things look bigger than they are, so your asshole got blown out of proportion. You're sadly depressed. You take drugs because you're unhappy and stressed. Which is why it's weird his real name's Sandy Perez. Because it rhymes with crack fiend on meds with badly depressed. Yeah. It's annoying when it's annoying when this prick acts scary and evil. He gets under the skin of various people. Heroin needle. That's why Chick calls Dick the heroin needle. <laughs> Shorty fucked your girl, so don't act tough and cocky. She said your dick's too short. 
so you can't fuck her properly. Your dick, your dick's a nine millimeter. She'd rather suck a shorty. <laughs> But he didn't do shit. He was actually okay. <laughs> now we all know he likes to get sh he likes to get cocky in fist fights, clown. <laughs> this is Manchester. I dare you to call Shotty a bitch right now. <laughs> It's so warped and weird that when kids look at you, it awakens their dormant fears. <laughs> I'd rather be stabbed with forks and shears, get scorched and seared, than have a face that can reduce a fucking corpse to tears. Yeah! Chop him up. Have his limbs auctioneered. Because half these people would love to see you hung, drawn and quartered here. Yeah, you got some laughs down south, a few roars and cheers, but before this year's out, I'm here to put an end to Kim Jong's North Korea. <laughs> Shout out to Buddy Bagnall on the cam. He be giving me stink faces because of my murderous rhyme schemes. He be giving you stink faces too, but it's just because you lack a personal hygiene. Stick to worshipping serpents and Tai Chi because you don't want to have a clash with Santi. You're a fascist man that's angry, a racist rapper that's using battle rapping as a patsy, so it's no surprise the name Zane is an anagram of Nazi. Oh! You're a Muslim raised in a vast Islamic family. So that means that the bad actions that you had will make the Prophet Muhammad angry. But it's Ramadan, a time for you to battle back the temptations that you have in fancy. So how come earlier? So you're back sipping a beer and you're having pastas. <laughs> Don't fuck champ, the rate of black will fit around you. You ain't a Muslim, cause there's nothing slim about you. You're just a blasphemous servant. Reading the Quran, sipping glasses of bourbon, speaking ill of the Prophet Muhammad and cursing. This angry anti Pakistani scally gladly only travelled to Mani to rally the ban on the burqa. <laughs> Plus, you look like the Mandarin version of Aretha Franklin in person. <laughs> Relying on the bullshit that you rap in your words like the teachings of Catholic churches are one of those angry unanimous verses. <laughs> <laughs> See, I'm a rapper with purpose. You're a one-man travelling circus who only gets laughs from the fans on the battling circuit yes. because you awkwardly try and battle the fact that you're handicapped with Asperger's. <laughs> and you've got a passion for burgers. <laughs> <laughs> and you're autistic. <laughs> racist. You're so fat you have fat in places where I don't even have places. <laughs> hey, you're a dickhead. I just, I've done ages ago, just go and send. In Leeds, in Leeds you started a fight with an Irish dude and call him a Catholic faggot. To the test dead Mickey Worthless on some actual fat shit. Yeah. If you, if this cunt disrespects my race, I'll rupture his head and face. You're getting killed by an Asian, so this whole crime scene will get covered in yellow tape. <laughs> when, your man, when your manager screwed you, you were too eager to fight. But I heard you sucked the Caucasian dude's wiener all night. That's why. You hate getting black bald. You prefer them white. <laughs> when, when Flex says racist statements, that's normal, mate. He just is black. Get it!
than her Blackberry. Yeah. in the mouth like my name's Mankind. Where's Zayn Azrai? No Rain Man's mind, but I face that cries, I have strange pastimes. With a waist that size, you ate mad pies. Bro, why'd you look one of James Bond's main bad guys? <laughs> see, the scene's changed, see the scene's changed mad times and in Britain it's tapped. Cause in Australia, you've never had a win in the clash. So either you're better here, which obviously isn't a fact, or the judges here have scrapped skill for gimmicky acts. See, I'm sorry to erupt into this cynical rant, but half these newcomers should be given a chance. Slipping, stumbling every minute they have, I ditch them all to bring in your window when they're pitting me back. Yeah. 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 In that. These egos and gimmicks be substituting bars for cheap jokes and lyrics like your battle with Mark. Receive loads of critic at the same time, don't flop views, achieve slopes in figures. It's like the scene sold his image, ain't nothing like the old school cause all these new battles got like three chokes that's in it. So put them against death, censor, me, ocean scissors and it's game over. Show them how an MC's supposed to rip it. Yeah. Till then these blocks need to keep low and zip it. This ain't bars over jokes, this is beasts over bitches. Yeah. Even doctors don't count 
They can't identify digits. I rap with incredible fitness. <laughs> I'm rapping for impeccable fitness. <laughs> Don't say you're gangster, that's not a credible image. When you were in jail, they stretch your ass to incredible limits. That's why he's soft. That's you're, you're soft. That's why you're flexible, digits. <laughs> Agent, don't flop, yeah, again, another sick battle. Um, I'm gonna be honest, to me personally, it had to go to flex pretty much all three rounds. Maybe round two could have been like debatably a tie, but to be honest, like his structure was so much more complex. Different Zane got a bit sloppy throughout the third, but he was entertaining, he was sick, shout out for coming over. Yeah, yeah, go to flex. Decent battle there between Flex Digits and Zayn Azrae. Right. Zayn was better than I thought he was going to be in fact. First round, I actually thought, yeah, I might even have marginally given it to him. I know it's controversial, but he was kind of hilarious and consistent, which I wasn't expecting. Fell off second round, Flex took that quite convincingly. And Flex definitely took the third round. So yeah, easy win for Flex really, but it was a good battle. Smith, whoever lives in that now, Tony Smith coming soon. Just done Zane versus Flex. Um, Zane's first round was crazy, as was Flex's first round, but I just feel what performance, flows, and consistency. I give that one to Flex. 3 0. Yep, peace out. Yes, what's going on, man? We're back here at DFAFD. We're here in the Don't Flop session. As usual, it's the 4th or 5th Blam, a sick fucking event. Shouts out, Con, every time. We're here at Summer Blam, man. July 2012. It's been a nuts fucking night about. The third hour for four hours, man. Shouts out, Con. Yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah, yeah.